In this video, I'll show you how to enable TPM 2.0 for League of Legends. As you can see, we can't play the game without TPM 2.0. This is because it's required for Vanguard Anti-Cheat System. So, if it's not enabled, we need to turn it on in the BIOS. First, type tpm.msc in Windows Search to open the Trusted Platform Module Management Console. As you can see, no compatible TPM can be found. This doesn't mean your computer doesn't have a TPM chip. It may be turned off in the BIOS, so let's try to enable it in the BIOS setup. Alternatively, you can use the Get TPM Complete in PowerShell to get more details about your TPM. As you can see, there is no TPM present. Now, let's restart the computer. Press the Delete key repeatedly to enter the BIOS setup. For example, this is a Gigabyte motherboard. Here's a list of common BIOS keys by brands for motherboards and laptops. Right after turn on or restart your computer, press the designated key repeatedly until you enter BIOS setup or boot menu. If you see a simplified interface, you can press the desired key or select advanced mode to show all menus. In advanced mode, use the arrow keys to go to the settings menu. Select the miscellaneous option. Make sure AMD CPU FTPM is enabled. Now, select Trusted Computing. Enable the Security Device Support option. Depending on your CPU and motherboard, the setting may appear with different names. For Intel systems, you can look for these options. For AMD systems, you can look for any of the following settings. Additionally, Depending on your motherboard model, the TPM settings may be found under a tab labeled Advanced, Security, or Trusted Computing. You can now press F10 to save the changes and restart your computer. As you can see, once the computer restarts, TPM is now ready to use. Now, you can play the game without any issues. In this part of the video, I will show you the steps to enable TPM on other common motherboards. First, enable TPM on a MSI motherboard. Steps to enable TPM on an ASUS motherboard. and enabling TPM on a Oshrock motherboard. Finally, Enable TPM on a Biostar motherboard. That's it. Thanks for watching.
Don't forget to like and subscribe and see you in the next videos.